Hey guys, what's up? I am playing Gator Chess. If I don't win this game of chess against the guy 200 points lower rated than me, I'm going to cry. I swear to God I'm going to cry. Mm. Bishop e3. I wish it was three minutes so I could um, win faster if needed. F3? Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, F3. Um, what, B3? Rook C1? They're all the same. B3. Alright, focus, Greg. A6, Knight A4. This is all theory. I've actually used to play it for black as well as white. So I sort of know what I'm doing. F5 is the main move. And I. Oh, this is like. I played. Somebody played this against me recently. Was it the same dude? I don't know. Uh, this is interesting. I'm going to take it. Okay, let's see what happens. I'm threatening, well, bishop h6, obviously. Uh, sometimes, there are some positions where you can sack the exchange. I just don't know if this is one of them. I'm just going to do this right away, see what happens. I think f4 is good. With the idea of bishop takes rook f8. If I'm not mistaken, I think that's the right idea. But most people in blitz, they, they, don't, they don't see it. Alright, now I think there's something wrong with this move, but I might be wrong. Let me think. Rook takes bishop, king takes rook g1, king h8, bishop h6. Uh, whatever. Only live once. This is really a little, a little respons irresponsible. Sorry, a little irresponsible of me. Um, the knight e5 takes f3 idea is something I have to keep an eye on as well. So, let's see. If he goes king h8, pawn takes pawn, bishop takes, bishop d4, wins some material. If pawn takes bishop f7, he can, he can get away with that. So, I can go bishop h6 right away. Then he goes rook g8, so I don't know how that helps me. Let's think, Greg. Let's think. If bishop d4, knight f6, right? Yeah. If bishop, if bishop h6, rook g8, I don't gain anything from that. I should probably take... Okay, I have some good ideas here, basically. Bishop d4, knight f6, pawn... No, I should take first. Uh, I assume he'll go... Oh, yeah, bishop f7. Bishop d4. If knight e5, f4. If knight f6, I was thinking bishop e4. And I'm going to win the b pawn also. I think I have good play for the exchange. Like, I'm going to win all his queenside pawns or something. You know, I just remember some I game where this idea was used. It definitely was not this exact position. But... You know, he has some issues with his king. So I think it's a good practical try, at least. Uh, what was my plan? This? Or should I? Yeah, 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 I'll just do this first. I'll force knight f6. Oh, crap. I just realized something annoying. God damn it. Oh, yeah, I just... Ugh. Why can't I ever do anything right? It's a big question in my life. He can go rook c7 if bishop b6, just knight takes bishop. Oh, no, then pawn takes, he moves the rook, bishop back to d4. Ow. <laughs> Hit my head with my little, my little cast. Uh, so we have an interesting... No, knight b6, just rook c7 or something. I'm going to just take it. This is a really crucial pawn, because I take the a pawn, and then I have this queenside mass that he has to deal with. It can be unpleasant. I think I'll just take it. Okay. 
So now what? I kind of want to just trade everything and go like. I kind of want to just take. Because my queenside pawns are dangerous. And then I was thinking knight, either knight b6 or knight c3. Probably knight c3 if the rook takes. We'll see what he takes with first. I have three pawns for the exchange also. Um, hmm. I was going to just take that. Let me think. If knight b6... I think I'll just take it and go... N oh, wait. Yeah, this is okay. Knight c3. If rook a8, no big thing. Just bishop b7 and I start pushing the queenside pawns. You know what I should do after this? I should play that, um, what's the, the site called where you just play Warzone? I should do Warzone sometime. I did that once. It was fun, actually. Although every game, somebody accused me of cheating. That part wasn't as fun. Mm. All right, let's, let's think. 94 looks tempting. Oh, uh, Rook A8, though. I have to deal with that. Let me think. I, I think I should just go Bishop B5. Let's see, 94, Rook A8. Yeah, I don't want to allow that. I think this move, and I have to watch out for him to play in D5. King C2 is also... Yeah, I'm just going to do this. And just roll my pawns up the board. Oh my god, I might almost be playing well this game. focus. Yeah, I guess this move. His king can't even come in, which is really awkward for him. Uh, if rook a8, I guess just knight to d5. I mean, he, he must be losing here. Well, look at that move. I guess bring the king in. If knight takes, rook d8 would have won my, my knight. So I, I had to avoid that. Okie dokie. Hmm. Probably knight takes, actually. Because now if he, 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 he tries to bring the king in, okay, I'll, I'm going to take this one. He's just lost. I have all his pawns. Um, next move of king d6. I just have to avoid moving my b5 pawn or my f5 pawn. Oh, he resigns. Yeah, because if he does this, if I move this, he wins the knight that way. And if, if I move this, he wins the knight that way. But I would just go a5 or something. And he's screwed. Boom! So you guys are saying I should not play Warzone? Kind of tempted. Kind of tempted. I only played it once. I, I think I, I won every game, but I didn't win the tournament somehow. I don't know how that works. But anyway, yeah, I played alright this game. I'm kind of curious... If my exchange stack is good or not good. Oh, I'm better. Way to go, me. Uh, didn't like that move so much. Why it says Bishop F? Oh, because he had um. Wait, no. Oh, Bishop takes Bishop check E5. I'm so stupid. <laughs> I just missed it. Fortunately, he did too. And then we get the... So this is the position we got in the game. But yeah, bishop e4 was a... It was a mistake. Right? Wait. No, no, it was okay. I can't remember. Rook c7 he had to play, right? I forget. What was I going to do here? I can't recall. So it thinks instead rook e1, and I just have nice positional compensation. Oh, because he can't defend because of this. Cool. Ace Rook says, yes, play Warzone. 
I'm confused. Um. Anyway, y'all, thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye-bye. How do I end this thing?